right folks, welcome to this exciting video. We're once again in the beautiful little fishing town, coastal town of Port Ellen here on the Isle of Isla. And look, we're filming the land room, we're up at this cute little filling station here. It's got so much character. We're just getting a couple of pictures of the land room, we're sitting in front of the old filling station. It's honestly just like travelling back in time, coming to a place like this. That's the Port Ellen distillery at the far side there. It's quite incredible. Alright folks, we're now in the little town of Port Charlotte. And I've got on the old Covid mask here. And look at this. The Museum of Isle of Life is located here. In this old church. The old kirk. And look at this outside. Massive old cannons. That'll be like the wheels. Most at one time here on Isla, or that was maybe from a big ship. Maybe a ship which at one time had been docked around the island somewhere. Yeah, anyway, let's go and take a look at the museum, folks. Look at this old vacuum cleaner. Some old pictures of the old towns. That's the mould for three candles. Look at the old keys. So this corner of the museum represents the two ships which we saw the monument for a few videos ago. The Atlanto and the Tuscana, which are the American ships.
much here as a lighthouse clock. a fairy engine folks about in 1910 that must have been something related to the smoking system yeah, this is a blacksmith's furnace That's the whistle there, from the HMS on Tranquil. That there is the whistle, that's cool. That's what the Toscana looked like, the one that sunk. This back, back room tells the history of Isla in the wars World War One, leading around to World War Two. Look, it's a Vickers K machine gun. This is what one of my subscribers suggested might have been an anti-aircraft gun at the Strathmore airfield. Yeah, the British Vickers. I think it was a, the first ever, like, automatic gun. I could be wrong. But it was the most popular. I could probably read it anyway. The gun was taken from Ferry Barracoon. A three-seat torpedo dive bomber crashed into the hull of Ben and Or in Jura. So this gun was on a plane which crashed in Jura. Look at this, folks. This is a spark plug socket. That's part of it there. Must have crashed. So those pl planes there drop depth charges to destroy U boats in the protected Atlantic convoys during World War II. There's that little boy's shades. RAF sunglasses. Back the wrong way. But also there must have been operating these planes which land in the water. Which makes sense for an island. These old stone carved balls here are from an ancient, ancient time. 
This is our reproduction. They're not even sure what they were used for. Look at this. Half a heave. pieces of light and glass there folks. Look at that. You're gonna put your hand behind it. Oh you can see how it takes the light from one area and directs it into two areas. Okay. Even this old thing here look. Like, this is an old Masonic lodge thing. Well it tells you there it's an, an altar. Masonic sign. Steamboat, all the way through till now the same ferry that we arrived on the island on. So this is like the oldest soda stream machine. This is the original fizzy drinks machine. One you still got a new version of this machine. <laughs> so that's been the Isla Museum folks, located here in this old car. I, can, I didn't even show you all they had to offer. There's so much interesting Little nuggets of history from all over Isla, dating back ancient times, like before World War One and all that. It's like, like these cannons and stuff that's at the side here. Even it's like they've got everything from household like history of the time to like military history, farming history, fashion history, and it's totally worth it. And it's located in this beautiful old car. It's got the old bell up on top of it. And also it was cool to see the other artefacts of history that match up with the sinking of the two ships which we saw the monument for in a previous video. But yeah, that's been a short little video I think folks. Maybe it's not been but I'll end this one here anyway. Thanks very much for watching and we'll see you very soon in the next one.